Hello everyone and welcome to my glorious new flower studio. If you do hear a bit of noise in the background, apologies, it's just our bike riders heading out on their deliveries. There was a bit of noise. Now this week I've got a glorious orangey green arrangement to bring you. It's very, very lovely and I especially love this wonderful umbrella grass it's called which is very, very beautiful. And then you can actually, when the rest of your arrangement goes over, you can take it out and dry it and it will look absolutely magnificent so you can keep it forever. Then alongside my lovely umbrella grass, we have these glorious Rosano Elizabeth chrysanthemums, actually named after Queen Elizabeth. Then this lovely Doria Cherry Santini, which are little mini chrysanthemums. We have some lovely Eucalyptus parvifolia foliage, which just gives a lovely bit of wildness and texture. And then in the middle, some of the architectural structure, some green Lysianthus and some orange antirrhinums. It's the only time we're using orange antirrhinums this year. Always make sure to trim a diagonal inch off the end of all your stems using floral scissors or secateurs, nice and clean as well, like that. And then fill your vase a third full of clean room temperature water and then pop in your flower food. To arrange, I'm gonna start with my lovely chrysanthemums and I'm gonna arrange them in an even triangle around the edge, like so. Then I'm gonna face my lovely Santini opposite each other and they'll sit at pretty much the same height. And then I'm gonna slot my two Eucalyptus parvifolia opposite each other, creating a square with the Santini. And what this does is creates this magnificent TP you see in the middle of the vase, which is very structural and allows the taller flowers to stand up in. And now I can very simply slot in or spear in my lovely Lysianthus. And they're a bit taller and they'll just stand very neatly upright in the middle, like so. And I can do the same with my antirrhinums kind of in and around the Lysianthus. I love the colour combination of this orange and the green Lysianthus. Very nice too. And to finish off, you can just slot in your two umbrella grasses, which will be a little bit taller still, and look absolutely glorious. So there we have it, a really beautiful arrangement with some wonderful grasses in it, which you must try and dry. So I hope you enjoy it and see you next time.